Today I will show you how you can take an OpenOffice Writer document and turn it into a template. Now a template is nothing more than a starter document that you would load up when you're creating a new document and instead of having a brand new blank document, you have the template. So whatever you save as the template is what's going to be your initial starting text within your new document. For instance, if I take the information I have on screen, the tutorial template, name, and then a couple tabs with an X, occupation, tab, X, favorite color tab, X, where these X's would ideally be replaced with some other information, like the real name, occupation, and favorite color of the person, I can take this information and save it as a template. And to do that, I would go to File, Templates, which is below Properties and Digital Signatures, as we've uh, discussed in the previous videos, and you would go to Save. Now from here, you'll be given a dialog box to save a new template. You would give it a name. For instance, I could call it the Tutorial Template. Hit OK. And now it's actually going to save that template inside of the OpenOffice Writer Storage. And to use that template, I would just need to go to New, File New, Templates and Documents. And you'll see the templates and the list of ones we can actually select which will have some extra information over here, uh, basically just the general information from the Properties tab of OpenOffice. We can hit Open on that. And then over here, we have a brand new document, which I'll track over here so you can actually see it. And then, bam, this is Untitled 2, Untitled 1. Untitled 1 was the basis for the template, but this new document, Untitled 2, has been created just by loading that template up. And you'll notice it looks exactly like Untitled one, because that's what we saved the template as. Now, if you wanted to edit a template, it's just like opening up a regular document on your computer in order to do so, except you would go to File, Templates, and then Edit, which will literally give you the open dialog box and file open. And you would navigate to where your templates are stored on your computer, double click them and open them up, and then save them when you're done editing. Now, if you want to manage your templates or possibly delete a few, see which ones you have, you can go to File, Templates, Organize, which will bring up the Template Management dialog box. And from here, you can see your templates by clicking on My Templates. Uh, Double-click to open it. You may have some stored directly in the My Templates folder, and others may be actually located under that. Now, if you actually want to make any changes to these templates, you have to right-click on them, which will give you other options, such as delete, which will obviously get rid of it. Make sure you actually want to remove it before you do, though. Edit, which will allow you to open it up and make changes to it before you save the template again. Import template, which will bring in other templates elsewhere on your computer or your network into OpenOffice Writer's list of templates, actually putting it on this My Templates list for easy access, and Export Template, where you can save the file anywhere on your computer or your network that you want to uh, as an extra copy or so that you can copy it over to some other locations on the network, online, on your computer, someone else's computer, or even a USB thumb drive. Printer settings is the equivalent of going to file printer settings, which opens up the printer setup dialog box where you can customize the print settings for each document uh, specifically. We've already talked about that though in previous videos, so we're not going to cover it again here. Now, if you've added some new templates into the My Templates OpenOffice folder, but they're not showing on the list, you can have them show by going to right click and update. You can do that on a template or the folder itself, which will Check all the folders again and see if there's anything new and update it with the new documents, the new templates, the new information. Lastly, if you want to have a template as your default one that you may use over and over again frequently, you can right click the template and go to set as default template. Now you should keep in mind that many people have actually submitted their own templates online where you can download and use them freely for any of your own documents and in many cases they're actually very good looking and very usable. You can get extra templates from the OpenOffice website so go ahead and check it out. I have a link to the templates page in the description in case you're interested. Aside from that, I'll see you in the next video. Till then.